Hi everyone and welcome to Connecting Consciousness Illinois. I'm Stanley Smith. You know, sometimes it's hard to see ourselves. Sometimes we need to look in the mirror. And sometimes we need to depend on others to figure out who we are. So what is Connecting Consciousness and who are we? Connecting Consciousness is a group of like-minded people around the globe, around our nation, and right here in the state of Illinois. In Illinois, we have over 1,750 members. We see anywhere from 40 to 60 people on a Saturday Zoom call, and at in-person events, we average between a handful of members and as many as 20 or more. The joy of seeing our members and hearing from them is knowing that they are looking back. We all see each other and they see us looking back at them like a, reflect, like a reflection. The truth is, we have not seen most of our members yet. Some don't even know there is an Illinois group. And that's, that's okay. <laughs> In this earthly existence, it's only necessary for enough of us to make the conscious decision for truth and against the everything else of this world. And what is the everything else? The everything else is what is manifest through our own consciousness as a result of the trauma and shock we have experienced in our lifetime and in the life of the world. We have all experienced the collective trauma of the preceding events, not just the events of the pandemic narrative, but of most of the events of our short lifetimes together. We are all in collective shock. And just like looking in the mirror, it's hard to see this. But once you start to see it in yourself, then you can start to see it and hear it in others, and then have empathy and compassion. We all replicate and model our thoughts, words, and actions around what is manifest of the trauma of the collective shock. We are all mirroring back instead, all mirroring this back instead of our true selves. During the pandemic, we've had time, time to reflect and do our own research. Many of us have gone down rabbit holes and been led astray. In the process, many, many people the world over have realized something's just not quite right in the world. And I don't mean poverty, famine, war, and sickness, all of which are significant and meaningful, there is something else, something else fundamentally wrong. And many of us are now seeing that something is out of place. One of these pieces is interfering with the true reflection. We do not need to solve this riddle or complete this puzzle. We just need to get enough of the pieces to see the picture. For many of us, we try to see this mirrored in the political, medical, religious, or even the spiritual. But at the end of the day, we need to see it right here, right here in the mirror. Darkness is trapped in this world, and because of this, it is inevitably exposed to the process of becoming conscious, where it will finally be eradicated. At the end of this narrative, the narrative that we're in, we do not need to change or be different or be anything that we're not. We just need to lean into consciousness just a little bit. And that is the point of connecting consciousness. They say that heaven is just three feet above the earth. We do not need to go very far from surviving to thriving. And this does not mean being perfect and it does not mean not making mistakes. It just means we all need to move just that, that little bit. This all sounds remarkably simple, doesn't it? As simple as looking in the mirror. We wonder why no one has told us this before. And that's because we all need to see it ourselves. Ourselves together. If you would like to learn more about Connecting Consciousness, I will include my email in the description of this video, and I look forward to seeing you very, very soon.